hello guys what's up welcome once again today I'm gonna teach you how to use tabbed pane so what is a tabbed pane tabbed pane looks like this whenever you click a tab this whatever tab you click the same tab information will be seen if you click this you can see another tab if you click this you can see another and if you click this you can see another tab this is really useful whenever in a JFrame you have little space and so many information to share so you can always use tabbed pane in order to make your information concise or intact at a place so just you can click and you will see the particular information in the tab so let's get started how to use tabs in your program so we have made our project now we will take we will go to the palette, take a tabbed pane, place it here. I'll make it a little bit bigger so you can understand. But when you see this, this don't look like a tab. This is because you need to add some tabs inside this tabbed pane how can you can do that go to your palette take a panel yeah you heard it right take a panel not tabbed pane take a panel drag it to your tabbed pane and when you see the dashed bar on the border of your tab pane just leave the panel or click the mouse so one tab is added in the same way if you want to add another tab drag your panel to your tab and when you see you have to drag it like that you should see the dashed border around your tab then only you should leave your panel and it will be like that and if you leave the panel like that only it will not become a tab unless this border you are not seeing if you leave the panel like that it will look like this so do it like that what happens when you need a tab inside a tab you can do that also how to do that just click outside on your tabbed pane or here where no tab is there right click it then go to enclose in and go to tabbed pane and close in a tab pane so you can see a tab inside a tab and then when you need to add these tabs here you need to just click here once again right click add from palette swing containers and click tabbed pane okay so there is one another tab this is first tab inside this three tabs are there second tab inside this there is no tab so you just drag a panel places in inside it so these tabs 
will look like this three two now how to change the name if you want to change this name right click it click the edit button and give the name for example user info right click remarks and documents you can give the names also from here like that in this way you can give this the names and one more thing you can select for example click your tab and go to the properties from here you can select index for example what is the index this top is a first index a zeroth index this low is a first index and inside this there is another tab where user info is a zeroth index their marks is first index and document is second index so you can go and change the properties default it should open the zeroth index you can change it to one so whenever you run the program it will show first in index whenever you run the program you can also change the position of these tabs from here tab placement right now it's on top you can click and you can see it goes to the bottom and you can make it on right so you your tab will appear on right and on left also your tab will appear on left so you can do that also and what else I think that's it for this tutorial I hope you have learned something new today and please do comment and give feedback to this tutorial so I can improve if any mistake I have done please give me your feedback and Thanks for now.